Hey guys, welcome back to another arena thingy. Um, I still need a proper name for this series. I believe this will be episode 6, but um, yeah. It's generally the same team as last time, How however, if, if you've noticed by the side icons, um, I, I have betrayed uh, Makaya and gone with Lindy. And I'll explain my reasoning in a second, but she's pretty standard. Um, Moonbow is mainly because I don't actually have Iceberg on her yet. Um, Fury 3, Desperation 3, and Fortify Resistance, I guess, is there. Um, speed plus 3 seal. Normally she's a Blah Blade set, but um, for the most part, this team doesn't really buff her. So, in general, I think Aura is a better option because she can actually heal units if she's nearby them, which this team's very defensive as is. Um, and then, I don't remember if I had this last time or not, but Olivia's gone back to being the Reinhardt counter set because I need a Reinhardt counter. But also because the weapon's a couple more BST, which is why I'm using Lindy, because even though Makai has more BST, um, the merges make Lindy better for my score. And as you can see, I've done not four already. Um, my score's pretty high, well, for me at least, um, because it's 720 plus on each battle. Um, for anyone who doesn't know, like last week in Arena, um, like I know I said I thought I'd be safe. I, I was not safe, I had to do so much grinding. Um, pretty much the threshold for tier 20 last week was around 720 per battle. Like, well, so I did 720 per battle and that put me at a reliable 3000. Um, 716 put you at like the very bottom at risk of being sort of KO'd. And then um, I think it was 718 would probably have kept you in. So it was a pretty harsh week to say the least. Also, this team has a Reinhardt. Savage Blow, okay. Um, you've also got Heavy Blade. Hmm. Oh my god. I mean, it's pretty, it's just basically, I have to, she'll move first anyway, so. Let's go. Oh my god. But yeah, so, for the most part though, it was incredibly hard to stay in tier 20. Like, if you were not, like using armors or anything and you were using a mixed team um you were gonna find it incredibly hard to stay in and that was the dilemma i faced i was kind of like well like this is great because i can't actually i i needed to regrind and i had to spend like 20 dueling quests just to farm out the good scores which originally i was using makaya and then i kind of realized that actually she's not doing me any favors like oh. I'm not getting any better arena scores from it, so... Also, I'm just thinking here, um... So, I need to rescue Olivia, which I can do with Lucas if I put Lindy there. And if I do that, Olivia's there. If Fjorm was to break down the wall, which she probably won't because she's got a rally, but let's say she did. Um, break it down. You are here, so you can hit there. Which would be Lucas, which I am fine with, to be honest. Actually, wait, 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 wait. She has Aether. Oh, God. I'll do it because I still think that's my best play. And especially because I've got a full play defense, so. Oh, yeah, like, she rallied anyway. Fair yeah, no. So it wasn't really so much of trying to beat units in tier 20 this week. It's mainly getting the good score. Which, with this team, is hard enough already because it's two blues and two colours, so as, single, as soon as a Raven Tome appears, I am done for. Let's go. <laughs> so you've got Ice Mirror, so it's nothing that Next major. Okay. Uh, well, we'll just heal you. Why not? But yeah, so in other news, um, the Sacred Stones banner got released. Like, if you haven't seen my reactions to it, for the most part, I am happy. Um, it's more of just the fact, oh my god, someone's actually using Fine God. I'm, I'm actually pleased. Understood. Um, sure. Time to shine. Let's go. Yeah, so I'm mainly happy because I love, well, I, I love Mara and Erica. I'm kind of impartial to Lara Shell, to be honest. But 
Um, no, so we got those. Erica is causing sort of a lot of confusion. And for anyone who doesn't know um, her whole Anamasis lady thing, um, it's Anamasis is basically to recollect or like another version of something. So when looking at it and the fact that the banner is called Sacred Memories, um, it's essentially a memory version of Erica. Which I, I really hope they call it Memory Erica or something like that. Like I, if they call it Brave Erica, I'll, I'll die. Because I've seen a lot of people get upset over the fact that, oh, Erica got a second form and she wasn't a break, like, she didn't win the thing. But at the same time, it's like, oh, I'm really sorry, but, like, I, m m the reasoning I'm seeing for it um, is because everyone complained that Ephraim got a weapon upgrade instead of Erica. And to be quite honest, um, oh, um, Erica's stats really lend themselves well to a main deck. High res, high speed, decent attack, and lowish defense, but decent as well. I can see why they just made her into a mage instead. But, anyway, more on that in a second. Um, you have Blizzard. This is a very strange team. Um, you are going to target them, aren't you? Yeah. Sure. Next step. You either of you have armor march, no they do not. Time to shine. So there is no way Next step. There's no way of anyone being able to hit me down, I believe. Let's go. Yeah, because um actually no if Effie No 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 yeah, because Jenny needs to be there, so I'll be safe there. Leave it to me. What next? Which is I've just made a mistake. Sure. Hmm. I'm just thinking here. Oh. Better to let them come to me. But yeah, no, like, I'm still happy about Erica and everything. Oh. Hmm. God. Um. Time to shine. Let's go. Yeah, like I said, I'm still happy about Erica and all that. Um, mainly because I love Erica as a character. I don't see anything wrong with it. And like I said, my she she she's been left out of a weapon upgrade. Like, I didn't think personally she needed a weapon upgrade, but um, a lot of people felt she did. So in some ways, that's great for them. But. I, I see all these people who are being like, Mage, Ephraim, when, like, it's not fair, and I'm like, no, stop it now, like, please stop it now and act like okay. an, a normal person, because, I, I don't know, I, I don't get why there's all this hate on Erica for it, this is or, um, like, the only reason I can see a valid reason for hating it is either if you just didn't like Erica as a character, or if, um, you're upset that there wasn't other Sacred Stones characters introduced, which, honestly, I'm upset that there wasn't other Sacred Stones, because we could have had Titus, but... Um, all in all, it's generally... Um, it's a mixed bag, I guess. It's one of those things people are going to love or hate, so... But, um, no, along with um, Erica, though, obviously, Larachelle, I'm not the biggest fan of her base kit. I'm hoping her stats are going to be really good to make up for it. But, um... No, Mer's the really interesting unit and who I'm probably going to be going for, because um, not only is she a dragon, she's a flyer, so um, she's, she's pretty amazing. <laughs> um, she, she is weak to... oh god, I don't know what I just knocked off then. Um, but yeah, she is weak to both um, archers and um, dragon slaying weapons, but um, in general though, I think it won't matter. Her weapon looks amazing. I think you just have to choose between... Well, actually, no, Distant Canter is the best because you can't use Steady Breath, so... But, um, no, in general, I think she's going to be the best unit. The other really interesting unit to note, which nobody noticed straight away, was um, Marissa is coming to the game as Crimson Flash. 
Um, I'm really hoping that arts from Bike Review. Please say it be done Bike Review, and I will use it then. I will have a red unit I want to use. <laughs> no. Um, but no, she's she's looking to be amazing. Well, I say that. Marissa's probably going to be amazing because she's like Ira, I guess, in a lot of ways. Um, and she's a Tempest Trials reward, most likely. That's what we're predicting. So, but yeah. Anyway, um, this match, Felsh and Lucina, pretty standard. Wasn't this person's name like an e or something? Oh god, two distinct counter horse units and a Fiorum. Okay, this is actually pretty easy. Lucas can just. I th I would even say Titania can't put up much of a fight here. Uh, Leave it to me. Hmm. Ready. What's the best way to do this, Kai? Time to shine. Not like that, Kai. Okay. Understood. Actually, no, maybe. Oh. And we might as well knock down that wall. But yeah, no. Like, in general, like, I'm just happy there's more Sacred Stones. I will say, um, if you're not huge on Sacred Stones, don't pull for these units yet until you know what's on the Legendary Banner. Because that's in, like, five days after this goes up. So, yeah, in general, it's going to be worth it to wait, I think, for a lot of people. But um, don't feel like you have to. Like, I know I'm going to be pulling for Sacred Stones characters straight away. Well, mainly Erica and Mer. But, um, you don't really have much to lose by waiting, that's what I'm saying. And I'm, I'm being asked it a lot, is it worth it to pull them? I think it's going to be worth it to pull them, like, regardless, I think they're all going to remain 5 stars anyway now. But, yeah. In general though, just wait if you're unsure, that's my biggest advice. But, anyway, hopefully that gets me a good enough score for this week. Come on, load internet. So, 5,062. I am happy with that. Like, <laughs> I think I had 5,058 last week. So I've technically done better this week. But, um, yeah, no. You're, you're going to need a lot of arena points. And I'm mainly saying the reason for it is probably because of Zelgius having, like, the highest VST in the game. And Fane, because she's a dragon. So... And I think we're going to see that over the next few weeks as well, since we're going to have Mer as a bonus unit. And Mer's a dragon, and she's probably going to have the highest BST in the game. That's what a lot of people are predicting. Um, well, maybe not, I don't know. Depends how they class her exactly. But, um, yeah. In general, this week had a lot of high BST units, so... But, um, yeah. And anyway, that's it for today, guys. Um, hope you've enjoyed the video, and I will probably see you tomorrow when the new units come out. Anyway, good time for now. Bye.